What's up, y'all? This is Dre, and I'm inviting you guys into my DNA search. For many of you wondering why I decided to do this search, if you are wondering, I just want to know. I mean, the African American experience, though it is very unique, we have a rich tradition within America. We overcome and we overcame a lot to get to where we are today, so I'm very proud of my heritage. However, I don't take the uh, American narrative as the end all or be all. I want to know exactly where I came from. I want to encourage all of my African American brothers and sisters around the country, St. Louis, find out where you're from. And so I got this tool, this little kit from Ancestry.com. It's called Ancestry DNA. Uh, I got it about 80 bucks. I'm thinking it ranges from 80 to 100 dollars. And there's a kit that you get with a little tube that you have to put saliva in. It has a little solution. So you have to put it in there, shake it up, seal it back up, mail it off, which I've done already. I spared you guys the saliva. So we're not going to do that. I already took care of it. And it takes about six to eight weeks to get back to me. So we're going to pick this back up about a month and a half from now. And we're going to see. I mean, hey, what if I'm Asian? Oh. Uh, what if I'm Bosnian? What if I'm uh, Roman? I don't know. Who knows? But obviously with dark skin, I'm pretty sure I'm from Africa. I just don't know where. Many of you know already. Some of you don't. Some people think that Africa is a country. It is not. It is a continent. There's various uh, countries on that continent. And I'm just trying to figure out where I'm from. Obviously, with me being in America, some of my people would have had to been taken from Western Africa, but who knows? That's why I'm doing this search. Uh, it does me no justice to just walk around and be labeled by people who don't even look like me. I want to know exactly where I've come from, and so should you. You should want to know it as well. And I want to, like I say, thank my daughter. She's doing the videos on here for me. She's going to edit it. So thank you, baby. All right, I'm inviting you guys in, so we'll see. We'll check back with you and man, probably the end of June. All right, all right, what's up, y'all? So I got my DNA results back. I got my little one, Loie. You want to say hi? Hi. Say hi. Look at her and say hi. Hi. All right, so I didn't open it. I'm just home from work, and I want to open it up so I can show you. So we'll just look together and see what's up. I'm kind of nervous. All right, let's see what we got here. So it's showing me that, wow, <laughs> so it's saying that I am 37% Nigeria, 22% Ivory Coast, and Ghana. And then it says 41% other regions. So let me... I don't know. I have to look this up and see. This is crazy. This one. Blue. I'm 81% African! <laughs> I am 81% from Africa, 16% from Europe, 2% from West Asia, and 1% from Asia. And so the breakdown is... Oh, I'm just shaking right now. My goodness. 81% Africa. And as far as... Uh, as it relates to nations, the dominant one is Nigeria. 22% Ivory Coast and Ghana. 9% Senegal. Uh, and then 7%... Cameroon and Congo. Mm. Now, man, 
sixteen percent from Europe. I mean, like, <laughs> I gotta check it out. Yeah. All right, let's go in. So as far as Europe West, eight percent Europe West. Now that's where you're gonna have Belgium, France, Germany, Netherlands, Switzerland. I mean, hey, you gotta welcome me in, you know. That's what it says. One percent uh, Italy, Greece. One percent Jewish and European. Jewish in my blood. And one percent Great Britain. And I've been trying to work on a Britain, a British accent. Two percent West Asia. The Middle East. Is at one percent, and the caucus is at one percent. Oh my goodness, this is crazy! I hope I'm reading this right. Thirty-seven. Yeah. My dominant. My dominant gene is Nigerian. Wow. I don't even know how to process this, y'all. I mean, this is crazy. I mean, my breakdown, there's so much there. I would have not guessed the 16% uh, European. I mean, that's a lot. That's a lot. And, of course, one thing that is really, really a shock, there was, you know, in a lot of African-American families, there's this uh, belief that we are uh, mixed with Indians. There is nothing Indian on here at all. I mean, there's there's no Indian trace anywhere, anywhere. So I mean, that that's very surprising. Uh, it was believed to be, or rumor has it, that if to protect African Americans from more of the atrocities or the horrors of slavery. Here comes a little short calling me. Hold on, yeah. Hold on, I gotta take this. Hello? Man, you will never guess. <laughs> you will never. Huh? First of all, hey, y'all, let's show on the phone. So this is so cool. I have 16% European in my blood. The other eight. I, I, it is a lot. I'm 81% African, and my dominant, my dominant, uh, I'm from Nigeria. I'm dead serious. It's 37% Nigerian, 22% from the Ivory, 22% from the Ivory Coast and Ghana, 9% Senegal, 7% Congo, 7%, well, there's a breakdown. I'm actually recording this right now. This is crazy. I am 81% African though. That's a fact. 81% African. 37% from Nigeria. Is that not crazy? I gotta go on recording. I'm recording. Bye. All right, so there you have it. I won't, I won't belabor it. I won't hang on. Check out Ancestry.com. So now I feel one of my goals was to, oh, I'm just kind of shaking. Once I find out exactly where I was from, that was my plan to actually visit. So I have to visit Nigeria. I have to look up, uh, I have to look up a lot of, their history, and I don't, I don't know, man. What do you guys, what do you guys feel about the sixteen percent European? I mean, wow, that's 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 crazy. But I accept it. I, I, I'm fearfully and wonderfully made, and so are you. And this was just my little journey, and I'm, I'm excited about it. I mean, obviously, my dominant gene is African, which I knew. The 
the breakdown is crazy. But I, again, I have to I have to go with that dominant factor, man. My my people are from Nigeria, so where you at, Nigerians? Reach out. And I want you guys to like this video, and I'm going to actually use this as a catalyst to start launching videos because I really want to help my people out. I can't uh, save my people. That's not what I'm trying to do, but I am trying to connect. So I want you guys to check out Ancestry.com. Reach out to me. I would love to connect you with them, and you can reach out on your own, and it's fairly inexpensive, so you're going to just do that the whole time. What do you want to say to the people? Who's your little Nigerian self? Well, there was definitely some surprises. I'm surprised. Wow. But again, Africa is 81% of my existence. I'm excited about that. I feel like it's very important for every African American. If you're not open to doing a DNA study, that's fine. But I, I believe that it's definitely in good taste to find out exactly where you have come from. Because I believe our narrative... In America, as far as the rich tradition that we have, is very shallow uh, and, and very superficial in many instances. So, uh, thank you to Ancestry.com, and yeah, I mean, I guess that's pretty much it. Wow, I, I had some nerves there, so I don't even know what I'm saying right now, but I'm so I'm ecstatic. All right, thank you, Deani, for helping me. And subscribe. And let's go on this journey. Let's see. Let's see more about our culture, right?